Hola hermanos, como esta usted? Hello my friends, how are you? I pray that you have a wonderful Wednesday. I wanted to take a moment before I start my day, before I even get my children up out of bed, to share a God thought with you. But before I do, I want to speak grace and peace from God the Father and our Lord Jesus Christ over your heart, over your mind, and over your life. God loves you so very much, and because God loves you so much, He wants to lead you daily. John 10, 27 tells us that we hear and listen to His voice, that He knows us, and that we follow Him. God wants us to listen to Him. He wants us to have faith in His promises and to rest in His love. You know, God has given each one of us some faith, but we also choose to have faith, and we choose where we place our faith. Some people place their faith in the things that they intend to do, or some people place their faith in their abilities. Some people place their faith in the people that they know are in their own strength. Some people even place their faith in their fear. Because fear is a form of faith. It's having faith in those things that you fear. God doesn't want us to have faith in fear or to have faith in anything but Him. In Isaiah 41.10, He said, Fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you, and I will help you. I will uphold you with my mighty, righteous right hand. I want to encourage you today to have faith in God, to trust Him, to take Him at His word, to rest in His love. In Matthew 9.29, Jesus said, According to your faith, it will be done unto you. And Romans 10.17 tells us that faith comes by hearing, and hearing by the Word of God. It is so important that we understand what God's promises are to us. The Bible says that my children die for lack of knowledge. I want to encourage you today to know what God's Word says, to write it on your heart, and to take in faith those things that belong to you by trusting in the Lord. <laughs> I want to encourage you to listen and to be led because God has promised to speak to you and He will speak to your heart and He will lead you today if you will trust Him too. And that's what I pray you will do. And I pray that you have a wonderful Wednesday. Dios te bendiga. God bless you and God go with you, my friends. In Jesus' name I pray.